All right, hi everyone. Welcome to Subnautica Below Zero. This is the full release. Yes, I'm starting over. I started a little too soon last time and that save had to be restarted. Honestly, I'm really glad I had to start over because they've polished this game a lot in the last couple of months before release. I'm streaming this over on Twitch. This is an edited version of that, but uh, I record at the same time I stream in full 1440. So you get the uh, full quality over here on the YouTube. And uh, I edit out what I say are the boring parts. You'll have to be the judge of that. But it's a base builder and an adventure game. A lot of the base building and material collecting can be repetitive. So that's the kind of thing I'm going to uh, cut short or edit out. But I want to keep most of the story and most of the adventure intact. Just a beautiful game. A lot of fun. Subnautica Below Zero, full release. Here we go. This is the farthest that I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me. And Sam. We need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Approaching 45, 46 speed. Surface temperature is Drop pod deployed. So, um, I think there's goodies around here, right? Um, I'm not picking up the flares, we'll just get eaten. But, uh, we're gonna pick up the filtered water. And New blueprint synthesized. More filtered water. And... She's running, she's running. I know there's more stuff here, and I'm just not seeing it. There's no rush, though. I'm also not going to rush through this one. Um, I think... Okay, I know there's a there's a nutrient block here. This is good. Open PDA. There's the PDA. I'm getting cold. Uh, let's, uh, let's take a hit off the heat plan here. There we go. Alright. There's another nutrient bar somewhere, I swear. That maybe they took some of them out. Nope, there's the nutrient bar right there. Nutrient block. It's a granola bar. Come on. And what else we got here? Yep, I'm missing stuff. Well, we're just gonna go. I've done the full circle. I'm not I know the flares could could come in really handy. I'm not picking them up. I'm just not. I'm making a, a statement. I'm making a statement. Holy smokes! That did not go as planned. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. Yep, working on it. Also, a significant amount of new music in the game. Um, and the music is incredible. I love the music of the first game, and the music in this game is uh, just as good. If some of it may be even better. All right. Why don't we pick up some stuff on the way over to the drop pod? What do I got? 30 seconds left? Yeah, see, it's just, it's the game loop. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. Oxygen. Yep. 
So, I came from here. I can always go back here, I think. I don't think I'm prevented from going back. I don't have a compass. Let's see if I can remember. I don't have a scanner yet. Um... Oh, 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 come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't make me do mad clicking. They might have made these guys faster. No, New I just think. 24 seconds left. Oxygen. Oh, I don't want to die before I get to the drop pod, you know what I'm saying? There, I can go faster this way. We're fine. It's fine. See, there's the sea glide once I have the scanner. But I need stuff for the scanner. We're gonna need some bladder fish too. I mean, I have the distinct advantage of having played this before, right? And the beginning areas were already were already done. Yep, get all this stuff. Oxygen. Jeez. <laughs> I need to I need to get back into the swing of things. This'll teach me with the really short times. Alright. Let me get this. Twelve seconds. Oxygen. Oxygen. <laughs> We're fine. It's fine. This is just where, where I'm expanding my lung capacity by almost drowning. Is this the little uh, overhang where the copper was stashed? Or maybe they removed it. I don't know. I got a lot of copper regardless. Uh, here's a bladder fish. We got 30 seconds left. Come on, bladderfish. There you go. Come here. Oh, I had it. New creature discovered. Yep. Doo -doo. Uh, air bladder. That'll help Oxygen. me. Oh, I was already doing it. Anything else before I get in? Titanium. How about some batteries? Ribbon plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. Just in case we need a battery. And 21 seconds left. I guess we'll head in. Let's head in. We're here. Down the drop pod. All right, let's I read. want to offer my sincerest condolences on the passing of your sister. I got to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546B, when we were thrown together as basemates at Outpost Zero. She spoke often and fondly of you. I thought you should know it didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things, kind, clever, Devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower, impossible to miss. I hope you find the answers you seek. Lillian Bench. I think my joke uh, last time I played through is that, lady, there's nothing impossible for me to miss. <laughs> uh, notice of death on behalf of uh, Zeta Landon. Um, so our sister died. And, uh, and then there's a bunch of messages from Sam. Uh, I guess we can go through this. Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian amphibian under real-world stress conditions. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. 4546B to Robin. Come in, Robin. <laughs> Remember when we used to play old-timey space explorer? 
This is kind of like that, but it's even harder to communicate. <laughs> well, let's see. I got your last message. Altera is not, as you put it, all terrorizing me. Things are going well. My project has a new name. Say goodbye to the mechanical avian amphibian and hello to spy panglings. We're training the bots to mimic the creatures. Check out the photo. And I think I'm kind of seeing someone. I know it's not like me to just find a date, let alone on a mostly uninhabited water planet, but actually, you know what? Forget I said anything. Yeah, it's, it's probably not even a real thing, but anyway, um, I'm sorry to hear Xenoworks might be strapped in the revenue department. Sounds like they still have you busy Xeno working, though. I still don't get the. I know that she no might way be to seeing some alien intelligence startup will succeed, but you've put so much into it. I hope they find a way to keep going. I know how much it means to you getting to work. Hey, Robin, I, I got your Augie photo. Thanks so much for taking care of him, even though he's a cranky potato. Hey, the nickname actually fits that way a cranky potato. I know he can be a handful, but I really appreciate it. I'm a bit worried about my other baby, the mission. One of my penglings found something, something big. But Altera is just like, nothing to see here. Honestly, kind of okay, glad that's... you can't answer. Hey, Robin, I'm sorry my last message was so awful. I've been under a lot of stress. Yeah, so here's where she says she's definitely not dating anyone. I don't know if this is something we're going to learn later on in the story or not. It's intriguing. I mean, if this was a, if this was a murder mystery, then definitely the person she thought she was dating is the killer. <laughs> I don't think it's a murder mystery. Well, we'll see. Uh, I can't even get my wash and dry. Okay, and then what's the last message? Hey, Robin. I really need someone to know. I'm afraid something terrible is going to happen. You were completely right about Altera, okay? You were right. I was wrong. The cat should be called Potato. I admit it. <laughs> mm, sorry. Bad attempt at a joke. I, I just... I don't know what to do. I guess I should just come out and say it at this point. I've said this much already. We found a frozen leviathan that's infected with Kara. Altera thinks they can use it for something. Weapons, experimental treatments, a whole range of things. But one end of the range is ugly, dangerous, but, but profitable, of course. What if it gets out while we're messing around with it? Or worse, what if it ends up a bioweapon in the wrong hands? I, I hope I'm overreacting, but... Okay, so that's that's basically the gist of the story. And uh, let's see, do we have anything else? The future of Xenoworks. Uh, this is the Xenoworks got bought, and it's one of those, hey, nothing's going to change, and you're all fired. Uh, Arctic Survival Al Almanac on arrival. I think some of this is new. Welcome to Adventure Mode, Xenoworker. You have arrived in an Arctic climate. Your great expedition begins. Our PDA is equipped to monitor your temperature and vital signs. Uh, survival checklist. Uh, don't die. And then the second one is uh, the surface high winds can result in rapid onset of hypothermia. If wearing a standard issue AEP suit, uh, bodies of water may provide safety from extreme cold. So this is kind of gameplay tips. Unexpected detours occur. Invest in a quality cold suit. That surely means there's a cold suit in the Cavity game. intake recommended. Mm -hmm. Oh, I was prepared, lady. That's why I got food. And then uh, we have some equipment here. Let's go ahead and uh, take care of these. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. All right, so let's uh, let's see. Let's make some food. Uh, we can cook. Uh, not the bladder fish. We want to cook the Arctic peeper. And we'll make some water out of the uh, bladder fish. We will, let's see, go over to inventory. Look at all these goodies. And uh, let's go ahead and eat the fish. Vital signs stabilizing. And take a drink of water and we'll stay like that. I don't want to eat the nutrient blocks yet. Uh, what else do we have in here? 
What can we make? We know how to make a scanner, right? We know how to make a scanner. Uh, let's pin it. And let's pin the survival knife. And let's pin the air bladder. Uh, and what's the compass? Copper wire and a wiring kit. I really need the compass. I really need everything. But let's start out with that. Um, the air bladder's easy. The compass is easy. The scanner is just... Uh, Oh, a battery. Okay, I can make, I can do everything. I can make the scanner right now. So let's do that. Uh, let's make the battery. And now let's make the scanner. All right, I have a scanner. Uh, deployables. Uh, we can make a locker. All right. Uh, sustenance. Um, we know how to make cured food, but we can't make it right now. And then what else can we do? Electronics. What do we have? We, we make the scanner. I can't get rid of it yet. Um, we just need some rubber to make the knife. I can go and get, get, uh, um, the creep vine seed clusters. I can pick those. Uh, for the bladder, it's a bladder fish and also some rubber. And then for this, the compass, it's wiring and we need silver for the wiring kit. All right. Uh, nope, I did that right. And then let's so let's unpin um, this, and let's keep the other stuff pinned. All right. Twisted man mandrake. Yeah, everything's scannable now. Bullseye shroom. Um, we're gonna need to get some pink narrow leaf. Get all these? Yeah. What are these dudes? I got those already, apparently. Yeah. Oxygen. Really need to get that tank, too. What is the, uh, what is the tank? Fiber mesh and titanium. Yeah, that's gonna help a lot. Okay. Alright, and silver... I should be going in the other direction, right? Yeah, I think the... the let's do this in a different order. I think the vines are in the other direction, if I remember correctly. No, there they are right there. And down we go. All Terra supply cache nearby. Nice. Alright. Let's pick some of these dudes. Blueprint synthesized. I don't know how many I need. I'm gonna pick a bunch. I'm gonna scan it. There we go. And let's go up. Oxygen. Mm-hmm. Remember you swim faster without carrying if you're not carrying a tool. I'm mainly talking to myself. And, uh, okay, I scanned a bladder fish. Thanks for cooperating. And, uh, now you're, you're, you'll be killed. Should be able to use this. Wait. What? <laughs> Isn't that long dark that always says that? Should be able to use this. Uh, I, I, I thought I had him. Well, let's scan him. Oxygen. Yeah. We're doing some more important stuff. We're good. Alright. Boomerang fish. Oh man, the fish are being so cooperative. It's it's really a shame I'm new creature then eating them for dinner. What's this purple stuff? Violet bow, cool. 24 seconds left. What happened? There we go. There was something else here. I swear there was something else. 12 seconds left. I gotta get this. Oxygen. All right, put the tool away. Swim up. Oh, it's gonna be close. Is it though? Yeah, it's gonna be close. A lot closer than I wanted it to be. 
two. No problem. <laughs> let's get this. All right, let's scan this. I mean, it's uh, it's mainly a, it's a completionist game, right? I mean, this 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 game feeds to that uh, that completionist. Where's my where's my ship? That completionist itch. Um, that oh, I gotta scan stuff. It's new. It's early in the game. I gotta scan everything. I need to go up. Oxygen. Yep, I'm there. Are these scannable? Nope. Did I get this? Scaly Maw Anemone. Yeah, you can't pick anything. But there are... So there are anemones that live... Oh, look, I'm right over top of this. That's pretty cool. What's down here? I was already down here. Red wart. 15 seconds left. Hurry, 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 hurry. Alright, I'm gonna have to scan more, but we're gonna have to go up. Oxygen. Yep. Where's the door? Where's the door? I'm Minerals a galore. Nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos Five. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Scanning at last. In goes the battery and titanium. Out comes the scanner. Um, this will give me access to a greater tool set. Research. Geologic data. Limestone outcrop. Titanium and copper. Indigenous life forms. Fauna. Arctic peeper. Edible. Bladder fish. Is also edible, but uh, we use it for water. And boomerang is edible. And then flora, I don't think I hit exploitable. Creep vine is the only exploitable one. So they separate them up. So you know which plants you can use and which you can't. Anyway, there's an anemone that lives under the ice that provides both food and a lot of water. Um, and hopefully it doesn't rot. And look at all the goodies we got. All right. So these fish don't rot unless you cook them. They're somehow alive, which is kind of cool. So um, if I don't cook them, we're, we're okay. Uh, so let's get out of here. Let's use the fabricator. Let's make some more water. And let's, let's cook the boomerang. And let's cook the peeper. And let's put that away. And let's uh, chow down on these things. And then uh, we didn't quite get full up on that. Anyway, let's drink a water. 71 and 77. That's good enough for now. All right. Now, what did I need? I needed to make some what? What can I make now? I can make lubricant. I can make a lot of lubricant. Did I need natural creep fan? Silicone rubber. Ooh, man, I almost, I almost screwed up. We need to make silicone rubber. Uh, we'll make one more lubricant and two more rubber. All right, now I think we can make a knife. A knife? Yeah, let's make the survival knife. All right, and uh, let's put this into one and the scanner into two. All right, and uh, then let's take a look at the knife. There it is, look at that, that's a nice one. Don't cut yourself. I would, I, <laughs> if it was actually me and I was wearing, you know, a rubber suit with a knife, that suit wouldn't last very long. That's all I can say. Uh, what else can we do here? Uh, we can make fins. Yep, let's make some fins. And then uh, uh, we can make another knife. Okay. 
So now, um, as far as what's glued, uh, we got a new blueprint somewhere. What is it? Lubricant, right? Oh no, the air bladder, we just need a fish that I already got rid of. So let's unpin the knife. And I have the oxygen tank pinned, yeah. So let's go out and let's uh, let's cut up some vine now. Remember it was right it was right next to the place? Remember where I saw it? Remember where it was? I need a beacon bad. I think I can get the beacon there it is over there. I think I can get the beacon recipe simply by going to the emergency cache. But uh, let's not get stuck under here. Hey, 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 hey. Gotcha. 18 seconds left. Here is an opening. All right, let's get up here. All right. Uh, let's put everything away because the sea monkeys right now are just kind of they're friendly pests that we should love and respect. Hmm. Hmm. I say I'm going the wrong way. I think I am. to get up. Let's don't. Uh, Twenty-seven seconds left. So I can make that O2 tank now. That's good. And I can make the bladder. That's good. And silver might be close, but I can't remember. I got titanium. I got lots of titanium. Where's my, there we go. Bladder fish, bladder fish. Thank you. Let's get up, 21 seconds left, no problem. Oh, that's right, I got fins now. I'm wearing the fins, right? Oh yeah. So I should be moving faster, theoretically. And there is nothing. Those were shrooms. Alright. Alright, let's make the... Um, no, no, no. No. Let's make the air bladder. If you are tired of hearing the word oxygen, the air bladder provides a significant upward thrust to help you get to air faster. Thank you so much. Let's uh, put it in five before I forget. There. And then, uh, let's see, the creep vine's going bad even as we speak. Uh, I need to make some fiber, whochamacallits? Uh, fiber mesh. And th th that's it, right? I believe that's it. Did I had did I get an extra one? I got an extra one. Um I will just eat it. There. <laughs> and so now I can make the O2 tank. Right. Let's make the O2 tank, please. Adding additional blueprints to your data bank. The standard oxygen tank can be upgraded for deluxe and VIP breathing. I still don't understand what VIP, VIP breathing is. I tell you what, the floating air pump and the pipes, this can come in really handy in a lot of, a lot of cases. Uh, I might actually try to use this this time and just see what we can do with this. Especially if I want to go deeper without the gear, uh, just for kicks. Um, but anyway, um, so we've got the tank on now. Good. Don't take it off. Okay, I've got lots of goodies. Uh, I've got an extra bladder fish. Let's go ahead and make some water out of that. Do I? Yes. Let's unpin some recipes first. Uh, let's unpin this. All right. And now we still have the compass pinned. Wait a minute. Let's unpin the bladder. We still have the compass pinned. I need silver for this. And what else do we want to make? Mm, flashlight? Battery and glass? Repair tool? Don't have sulfur yet? Uh, flares? No. Waterproof locker? Maybe. Maybe. And we just learned how to make the computer chip. I need the table corals for that. And uh, I, think, I think we're good to go there. I really want the compass. But I need silver and gold. 
And yes, I, I believe. Yeah, and so, yeah, it's not argentite anymore, right? It's just silver and gold, which is interesting. That, that, that had to be a last minute change, I think. Uh, do I have any storage in here? You don't have any storage in this little. Yes, you do. Uh, so let's store this stuff as much as we can, anyway. Wow. That's a lot of storage. All right, and uh, let's store the food. And let's make uh, some water out of that bladder fish. Let me go on a food run real quick. Uh, there's another bladder fish. Uh, nope, you can put you can put it away. It's okay. Peeper. Nailed it. Uh, let's put you away. And let's get one of these dudes. 42 seconds left. Wow, at night they're all... Well, now it's moving around, but they all seem really slow at night. I don't know why that is. There's another one. Gotcha. I saw a peeper. I missed him. Um, we can get some of those for batteries. There's a bladder fish. Oh, I want to scan you. Two. Hoop fish. And then, as appreciation for you letting me scan you, uh, we'll have you New creature dinner. discovered. Oxygen. Oh, jeez. You can definitely swim faster with the tool um, when you have the fence. Wow, look at this. Alright, we must be cautious. Aha! Coral Bridge. Scan you. 50 seconds left. Uh, here we go over here. I need to get to that emergency supply cache next. Anything else to scan? I can't scan you, right? No. I've got a lot of quartz. Anything to scan down here? Nope. Yep. Uh, right, let's open up some storage, and what am I going to want to store? Maybe nothing. Uh, let's go ahead and cook some food and get up to full. Uh, and we're just going to eat them all. All right, that's going to be it for this first episode. Uh, the remaining episodes will be about 45 minutes in length. Uh, I wanted to make this one a little bit shorter because it's the first one. And uh, there's many, many more hours left to go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.